So hi everyone, my new book Lanchin in your pocket beginner's guide to building gen AI applications using LLMs is out now on Amazon. The book is already a bestseller as you can see it is trending on hash 3 on Amazon bestsellers. So go get, grab your copies and find the link in the description below. So hi everyone, today in very short we will try to understand how you can visualize a lang graph. So lang graph as I have already told in my previous video is an extension of lang chain that helps you to bring cyclic graphs. So they are more complex than chain but not fully automated as agents so and have a great utility that you can check in my previous demonstration in this particular demonstration my focus is towards visualizing the lang graph object that you have created as it is not directly mentioned in the documentation there is something that you need to know for a better presentation so let's get started so basically there are two ways in which you can plot your lang graph one is the image based as you can see here and the other is the ascii based as you can see which is used uh, uh, presented using ASCII codes. So let's get started. So first of all, you would be requiring to pip install GraphWiz and PyGraphWiz is very important. And PyGraphWiz does create a lot of problems. So do search out with your a particular OS that you are using, be it Windows, be it uh, Mac, be it iOS. So how to install PyGraphWiz? It won't be as straight as pip install in PyGraphWiz. So eventually in Windows also. I need to do a certain tip, uh, tricks to get this installed. So once you are able to install GraphWiz and PyGraphWiz, you need to import ipython.display. I am using a Jupyter notebook, that's why. So this is basically the work, uh, workflow, the, the graph with, uh, the gra lang graph object that you have created. I'm not jumping into the basics of lang graph yet that you can check out. So once you have created your lang graph object, which is in the workflow variable, you need to compile it to create an app and eventually call this particular function image app.getgraph.draw underscore png so your entire graph would look something like this you can see that conditional edges are also added as it is telling the names key okay if it is go it uh, goes to this side it is handle greeting if it go comes this side it is handle llm you can give it a different name also a uh, different colors are used as you can see it's quite beautiful to look at now if you want to go with a, a lesser fancy option you can go with the print ascii code method so in this case you need to pip install grand elf it's a package it's a easy pip install that i did and then again workflow dot compile the app object that you got you need to do app dot get graph print ascii so in this way the entire graphs as you can see is visible to you as you can see that the options are not coming here that we have in a conditional ad that were present in the print png option but still a good option if you are facing a lot of issues with pygraph viz you might be so this is how you can visualize a lang graph object in Jupyter notebook or in any other notebook also. Thank you.